interactive environments are a great way to keep the player entertained. So what is an interactive environment, you might ask? An interactive environment is, or let's say that there's a treasure chest, and you can't get to that treasure chest because there's a rock there. So you gotta find a way to move the rock. That's one example. Another example would be, let's say you had to meet the mayor of a village, but on your way there, you notice that there was a recent landslide, and you can't get around it, so you gotta find another way around it. Interactive environments can also mean puzzles inside of dungeons. Similar stuff. Let's take, for example, there's something blocking your path, so you need to find a red orb, stick it in the wall in the right spot, and boom, it blows it up. You don't want to go too far with it though. You know, you don't want to have a bunch of things where the player has to go around all the time. So in other words, don't throw a bunch of random things at the player at a constant level. Instead, just kind of throw it in every, every once in a great while. Secret passages are also another good example of interactive environments. Let's say you're walking around and you notice that there's a lot of vines concentrated in one small area on a rock. If you have any items that can light something on fire, you can use that to find yourself in a hidden room. 